This video is going to show you how to fix Microsoft Word in case uh, it's freezing up on your students. We've noticed that it's freezing up if they're trying to use bullet or they're trying to use numbering or the outline. Uh, they'll click on that, then Microsoft Word will just freeze and then it crashes and the students have to restart it and so on. This usually happens, we've noticed, when students are using Gmetrics, which is software that the business ed teachers use. So we're going to show you how to reset that. If it does freeze and freeze up, close out Microsoft Word. If the student was using Gmetrics, make sure that's closed out as well. Then what you do is you want to go to My Computer. So you might see a My Computer icon on the desktop. If you don't, just click on the globe, go to Computer, and then you'll see C Drive. That's what we want to go to. So Computer, C Drive. Once you open that up, you will see a folder called Users. So let's open up Users. Once you open the Users folder, you are going to see a folder with that student's name on it. Um, now this is where it gets tricky. You may, this, you may be able to do this while the student is logged in, if they have permission. It seems to vary from school to school. Uh, you may try to do this while the student's logged in and you don't have permission or the student doesn't have permission to do this, to even go to the C drive. So you might have to log off, log back in using your teacher username and password and then do this, then log off and have the student log back in and start back into Word. You know, it's kind of a tricky thing. So again, we click on My Computer, Users, and then you'll see the student name. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to double click on my name and open that folder. You would double click on the student name. Please excuse this uh, color scheme thing that keeps popping up. Once I do that, I'm looking for a folder called App Data. And you can see I don't see it here. So what I need to do is go to Organize, go to Folder and Search Options, click on that. Then you're going to see a tab that says View. I'm going to click on View. And then underneath this section here that says Hidden Files and Folder, select this option here that says Show Hidden Files, Folders, and Drives. Click Apply. Click OK. Then you'll see that folder called App Data. It's a hidden folder. If you don't go through the steps I just showed you, you'll never see this folder. So open that up you will then see a folder called Roaming. Open up Roaming. Then you want to go down to Microsoft. Open that folder. Then you want to scroll down and find Microsoft Word. Open that folder. And then you'll see this little data file. It says listgal.dat. That's the thing that's begun, that's started to be corrupt. That's why you're having problems with the bulleted list and stuff like that. All you have to do now is just delete this file. I'm going to right click, delete. It says, do you really want to delete it? Yes, I do. It's gone. Now, close this out. You're done with this. Then you can just go back, restart Microsoft Word. It's going to install that file you just deleted. It's going to add it back in, but it'll be the one that's not corrupted. Now the students can use bullet and number and outline, and they won't run into any problems. Um, even if they're using Gmetrics, it should work fine. They shouldn't have any issues with that.